This video will guide you through the use of the electrical system. There are three key components. The power supply unit, or PSU, a combined mains consumer unit and 12 volt controller that is usually located in the front offside underseat storage area or wardrobe. The swift command control panel to manage and monitor different functions for which there is a dedicated video. And the source of power, either mains hookup or a leisure battery. Let's start with the PSU and the seven different areas. This system shutdown button is an isolation switch for the 12 volt system. The reverse polarity indicator is a warning light that there may be a problem with the mains electrical supply and you should speak with the owner of the electrical supply you are plugged into. The charge switch is illuminated when the charger is turned on, allowing the leisure battery to be charged, but only when on mains hookup. The heating system switch is for switching off the mains electrical supply to the heating system. The 12 volt DC fuses relate to the circuits in the living areas like lighting and fans. And the residual current device or RCD and test button along with the miniature circuit breakers act like a domestic consumer fuse board protecting the system when on mains hookup. Before connecting the mains hookup, ensure both the isolate switch and the charger switch on the power supply unit are off. The hookup point for the mains electric is located in the exterior side locker. To connect, first plug the lead into the caravan socket and then run the cable through the dedicated channel so that you can close the door. You can now connect to the mains. Make sure the cable is spread out under the caravan and not coiled as heat could build up and result in a melted cable. Always position the cable so as not to be a trip hazard and avoid driving over the cable where possible. On the PSU, press the RCD test button to confirm that the RCD turns off and then switch the RCD back to the on position. Also ensure all miniature circuit breakers are in the on position. You can now turn the black system shutdown button to on. The leisure battery sits alongside the mains hookup inlet and to prevent any damage to the locker from possible battery leaks, a dedicated tray is provided for the battery and the compartment is vented. Swift recommends UASA leisure batteries. Make sure the positive and negative terminals are tightened onto the terminal of the battery. If the connection is too loose, it can cause sparks. Use the strap to secure the battery in place. If your caravan is fitted with a solar panel, the regulator is usually located in a kitchen cupboard. The flashing green light indicates that the panel has enough sunlight and is outputting power. The red light is the charge status. The regulator can take up to 200 watts, allowing you the opportunity to add another solar panel. 